Radio Bokusam will be here by band from 8 p.m. to 6 a.m. in all areas outskirts of the South Town, such as Mari, Dampa, Tsunami, Barakalau, Samau, Gadabu, and Yau, Yau East. Security force are here by order to shoot any riding motorcycle between 8 p.m. and 6 a.m. in the outskirts of the South who refused to stop when ordered to do so by them. As of today, any guests that seek accommodation in any hotel must produce a valid identification card. Any hoteliers that contravene this directive will have their license revoked by them. Inshallah, with the new strategies and the new why we were all the security stakeholders to combat this hydra headed monster, the end of politics in Assad in Assad. More than any other time, I call on all well meaning people of the protests to continue to assist our security forces with prayers and goodwill. The fight against politics and extension one, we have all seen how a social problem that began in a remote part of them for over ten years is gradually threatening the entire Northwest sub region. We will continue to provide support to the victims of banditry and do everything humanly possible to secure our communities. A government delegation recently toured Bukum, Anka, and Gumi local government area, and it is embarrassed to commiserate to the victims of recent tragedies, provide them support and uh, assure them that the government is doing all it can to surmount these monumental challenges. We have dispatched a similar delegation to the the local government area where a similar gesture was extended to country affected communities. I see this opportunity to once again commiserate with the people of Anka, Bukuyum, Gumi, and Sakajiki of the local government area about the laws they encounter in the recent attacks. I would like to also use this opportunity to thank our communities for providing shelter the, to the displaced person, most especially in Gumi local government area and Bukum local government. May Allah reward you abundantly. Also, strengthen the spirit of brotherhood among our people. Since the struggle against the insecurity calls for coordinated efforts, I would like to urge everyone in the set to exercise portions and work with the security personnel to win this battle. Everyone has a part to play in finding solutions to our security concern, however little or big it is. It is important to know that our new strategy encourages active public participation in matters of security in our communities, Defeating budget to require concerted effort. Everyone is a stakeholder in achieving these desires. My dear people of the protests, for the first time in the history of our dear state, we have secured the emergency communication center for the current Ministry of Communication and Digital Economy in order to give our people a platform for communicating in the emergency scenario. A squad of rapid response security forces is stationed for swift response at any time, any day, for any of the 14 local government areas of the set. The national emergency number is 112. You can dial 112. Should be used exclusively for emergency only by all the present inhabitants. The call are all 12 free calls. Before I end this address, I would like to commend those SYL bandits who have repented and supported our peace effort. I salute their sense of their spirit for For their communal peace and harmony, which spare our community of Shankar people, the Maga, the Zulu, the Kansa, the Omar, the Koran, and the Maradu local government, for the audience of the recent past. These communities have now experienced an unprecedented period of peace 
ranging from two to three months without any incident recorded. For those who have opted for the continuation of their discarded acts, they should rest, be assured that their hideout have been discovered and they will be crushed very soon, inshallah. I implore our people to keep praying for the government success as we implement our new measures to deal with the situation decisively. <coughs> but the Almighty Allah restored the magnificent, magnificent era of peace and prosperity we once had in the state and the entire country.